Hi guys, Crave LPS Horse here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make the intro or how to make an LPS intro for your channel like I did. Um, if you didn't see my newest video, it is my intro. And today I'm going to show you how to make it. Um, my phone is a Samsung, so I can't make it on my phone, but I'm going to be using my mini iPad today. And you need to have an Apple product phone or iPad to do this, or else you cannot do it because Samsung does not have Video Star, and we're going to be using Video Star. And basically, you're going to start out by make sure you have a background. I just saved this white background on my iPad, and I also saved this picture of my mascot. And yeah, now I'm going to find another picture of the Egyptian cat because I want my Egyptian cat to be in it. So yeah, let me go find a picture on the internet of that. I just find this found this image. Now make sure whenever you find your images that it has a white background and you can erase this stuff. Because if it's not a white background, then it's gonna blend in not never mind. It's not going to blend in with the white background for the back, so it's gonna look really crappy. So make sure that it has a white background and make sure that if it's like there's a white background but there can be some colors but you can erase that so that's not too much of a problem so i'm just going to save this by holding it actually go to here watch it go to view original image and the original image then you can save it as the original image because it's easier to save and you just press save image and you save it and that's all the images I'm going to use. So now we can go into Video Star. And sorry about that. That's my other one. Um, anyways, you can find any song you want. Let me pick my song really quick. Okay, so I picked my song. Now you can like adjust the speed and stuff. By the way, this is not my song. This is Kid in Love by Shawn Mendes. So yeah this is his song it's not mine and all credits to him for this song because i really like it but yeah um you can change the speed and stuff see let's wait see and you can make it really fast or i can make it lower and you can make it really high pitched um, I'll be back once I'm done picking the speed and pitch. Oh, and by the way, if you want to do the pitch so it's not like this, then you can do this on the unlock button, and then it's like that, so. Yeah. Okay, guys, so I have got it done. So now you should be brought to a screen that looks like this. You're going to press the plus button, and go into the, kind of like the little picture frame right there. I don't know if you can see that. It's like the little frame one, I guess you could call it. And it's right next to the running man. And then you're just going to scroll over and find the one that kind of looks like a galaxy, I guess you could call it. It's called user photo and it looks like this. Then this should pop up and you're gonna pick pick photo and then go to your camera roll and find the white background and click done. And then you'll bring, this will be brought up. And then you're gonna press this button right here to go down. And then you're gonna record it for at least 10 seconds, 10 seconds, because that's how long normal like intros are. It can be a little bit shorter, a little bit longer, but don't do it like a minute because that's really long for an intro I just use um, 10 seconds so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and do that okay guys so I have recorded it for at least 10 or 12 seconds and now you're confused because like where the image or video go and all you have to do is click the scissors and you should be brought to it mine was a little bit longer it was 11 seconds but that's okay now you're just going to click new and re-effect clip. Now you will have to pay 
99 cents and 199 or 299 I think so that you can reaffect it but yeah you will have to pay for that but it shouldn't be too much so now that you're on this page you're gonna go here that's my other thing there we go you go to this plus button and go to the man that's running and then go over until you find the one where the girl is holding a star that's like, it's called photo track, it's right there. And then click pick photo, go to your camera roll like we did the first time. And sorry about that my camera roll, focus, focus. It won't focus, it won't focus, focus, focus. Is it focused? I'm pretty sure it's focused now. Anyways, you're gonna pick the image that you want. I'm gonna pick my Cocker Spaniel first, and then do next, and just click none, and then do erase, and erase this. You just have to click on wherever there's words, and then you click next, and create, and then you're gonna do the down button again, and I'm gonna get her out of the way. Do re-effect, and you can do that, but I'm gonna cancel that. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, so now, that you have this, you're gonna go to this and you can click any one so I can go in however you want. There's so many choices. I think I'm gonna do this one. I'm gonna make it a little bit smaller and I'm gonna have it come in about right there because I'm gonna put the Egyptian cat next to her. So I'm gonna wait about one second to put it in same with the Egyptian cat, so that they're both come in at the same time. Go down, and then do re-effect. One, click. And wait until it gets a little bit farther down to let go. Right there. There we go. And then once you got that recorded again, you will want to do, watch it and make sure you like it. And now you're going to click new, re-effect clip, and then go to the plus button again. And then make sure you go back to the picture frame. Not that, sorry. Go into this and go to the star movement, movement again that we did before. With the girl holding the star that's coming in. Tap pick photo. Camera roll. Crap. I didn't mean to do that. Camera roll. Why am I doing this? Camera roll. There we go. Then you're going to click the other picture. Do next. And then do none. And erase. And erase this and these words. Now be very careful. Like that might happen. And that's bad. But if you click this eraser right here. Then it can draw back and you can draw it back. So make sure whenever you're doing that it's really small. So I can just erase that. Because you do not want to erase the actual LPS itself. There we go. Now I'm going to click next. And then here's that. And click create. And then you're going to go to this again. And I'm just going to have it come in the same way. Because, yeah. And maybe a bit bigger, I guess. There we go. Now I'm going to click this button. Re-effect. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Never mind, cancel that. Make sure that you edit this and make sure that you delete most of it so that it won't affect the other picture so that's not in the other pictures way. Well, sorry about that, I, guys. I forgot to tell you that, but make sure that's not in the other pictures way. So just kind of erase as much as you can all the way over. So I'm going to make this a bit smaller here. So I can get in there. There we go. Now next. I think this should be good enough so that it won't be in the way of the other one. So now I'm going to do it the same and make sure I know where to put it in at. About right there. So we effect. And then wait like we did the first time. 
There we go. Now, the beginning, they didn't go in at the exact same time, but that's fine. Do you see? They come in basically the same time. And they go out basically at the exact same time. So, yeah. And then you're going to do new real effect clip again. And then you're going to go to this plus, go to the T, so I can do text. And pick the one that you want. Um, I like this one, but there's different ones too. There's a ton. Um... There's so many to pick from. I like this one a lot. I think it's really cool. But you do have to buy some of them, so be careful of that. Make sure you know that you have to do that. Um, that's cool. I kind of like that one. Uh, let's have to type in. I'm going to type this in really quick because it's going to take me a long time to type in. And there we go, that's how mine would look like, and it looks really cool, I think. And so I'm just going to do a re-effect clip. Just wait all the way until it's done. There we go, and now it's done. And you can add anything you want in here. There's so many things to add, so yeah. And that's how mine looks like. Now you're going to click done. And once you're done, click X. And then here it is. And you can do this. Send to camera roll. And you can email it. If you are on your um, iPad and you have a Samsung that you edit your photos, videos with and upload on mm -hmm. your Samsung then you will have to um, upload this video onto YouTube and then you can use video and then you upload the video that you want this to be in front of and then you use YouTube's video editor to put them together um so yeah that's kind of the bad side about it because I tried to email this to my Samsung and it wouldn't let it work like it wouldn't work you can try but for me it didn't work but it might work for you. So yeah, hope you guys liked this video. Okay guys, I hope you guys liked this tutorial on how to make a intro for your LPS channel. And yeah, I hope you guys liked it. Sorry about the really bad lighting. Um, it's not very bright out, so the natural light isn't really coming out that much out of my windows. So yeah. I hope you guys like this video. Make sure to watch my other tutorials or DIYs, I should say. And yeah, bye guys. And maybe in the future I can show you guys how to make an LPS outro. And yeah, bye guys.